morning, cool cats. So this morning, Ethan's playing skate, I guess. Alex is laying on the couch with Luca. Are you spoiling her? I'm cold, so I'm using her body warmth. <laughs> <laughs> I finally beat the whole game of skate. Oh, good job, honey. And Richie's relaxing this fine morning. Aren't you, Richie? And I'm editing yesterday's video. Okay, guys, so right now we're getting ready to play The Last of Us. Um, sorry if it seems like I'm yelling a little bit. I don't know if I am because I'm kind of losing my voice. Um, this morning I woke up and tried to talk to Luca, and I was, like, really trying to talk to her, and I couldn't <laughs> talk. So um, I have to be louder a little bit. But, yeah, we're going to play The Last of Us. I have my soda and my big bag of Starbursts. We're all going to take turns when someone dies and it's the next person's turn and so on like that. And, uh, yeah, I love this game. It's so fun. I can't wait till number two. I saw the trailer and I freaked out. I was like, yes. So, uh, yeah. Ah, oh, that dumb clock. Every hour on the hour up until, like, six or seven. Is it till seven? Um, like yeah, six or seven p.m. It just dings every hour for as many... Ugh, so annoying. Anyway. <laughs> it's a cool clock, though, but it's just annoying. But anyway, um, today, I, I, this morning, I just edited the video that goes up tonight. Um, we're about to play, what is it called? The Last of Us. The Last of Us. I was going to say Walking Dead because it's a zombie thing, and so I was mixing them up. The Last of Us, and uh, the boys are brushing their hair and their teeth. Getting prepared to play the video game. Um, if you don't know what The Last of Us is, it's a very scary zombie video game. And it's like post-apocalyptic world where, um, you know, there was like a virus that got out or whatever. I don't know exactly the, the um, details, but it's a very scary video game. We played it back when we lived in Santa Clarita, California. When it first came out, I would not recommend it if you, li if you don't like scary things because this is like an extremely scary game. And I don't recommend it if you don't have your parents' permission. But, um, so we're about to play it. You guys ready? Yep. Alex is sitting relaxing over there, leaning back. I love the music in this. I want to find out who uh, composed all this music and stuff. It's all nice and acoustic. And stuff. Yeah. She's been sitting up there. I'm going to be first player. And what we're going to do is I'm going to play first, and when my character, when I die, then the next person takes over. Who's number two? Alex. Okay, me, then Alex, then who? And then you. Aww. You got last. Yeah. You got last. I got first because I'm the mom and I said I'm first. <laughs> <laughs> they had to play rock, scissor, papers though. Rock, paper, scissors. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Whatever, rock, Ethan. <laughs> Maybe we should restart rock, paper, scissors on camera. No. Anyway, all right, we're about to play. One. I'll just see on my second Okay, so we're playing the game, and it's Richie's turn. Why is this guy just wasting time? Seriously. How do you realize that? Okay, so I stopped playing the game because it's a little bit too scary for me. I mean, I enjoy watching it and attempting to play it, but it was just too scary for me. I get too, like, I don't know, uh, get too scared. And Alex stopped the game to do the dishes. Thank you, honey. So she's getting the dishes done. You guys having fun? Okay, so we're in the backyard now. Well, Ethan and I are. He wants to show me a trick he can do. What are you going to show me? I might need socks. Be careful. Let me come around. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I can do it right here. I might eat You're my little monkey boy, aren't you? One last try. 
You can do it, Ethan. Good job. Oh, you okay? That was so cool. Are you okay though? Yeah. Oh my goodness. I was a ninja. <laughs> <laughs> how do you how did you feel? Were you scared at first when you were falling? No. I'm gonna try it right here with nothing. He's my little risk taker. <laughs> Be careful, honey, you could fall and hurt yourself. I know. Okay, so right now she's gonna try to go upside down. Not try. Or do. Oh, to see if you slippery. can see if you can do it. It's kind of slippery because I have pants on. I've I've really soft pants, so it might even be more slippery for me. Yeah. But it's hard because my hands are slippery. My hands are. If my hands are slippery, I just still hold on. I just get more grip. Try to do it with no hands. My hands are slipping. I'm not going to do it with no hands. Can you feel me try to do it with no hands right here? Can you try to do it with no hands? It's pretty easy, but my pants are slipping. And then my hands are slipping. It's about to fall off. Slipping. slipping. Oh, my hands are slippery. I'm going to slick. I can do it right here. You need a haircut. I know. I put my hair on the side right there. Yeah, he put his hair behind his ears. I wanted to look like Maggie. Oh my gosh. <laughs> no, I didn't. Maggie looks good like that, though. I know, because she, she has longer hair. And she's a woman. Yeah. But you definitely need a haircut. I look like some opposite face of Maggie. Nuh-uh. That's the uglier Maggie. Come on. I just did it. Why can't you do it? I I'm falling. Never do it that way. I always do that. Imogen's a professional at it. What? Imogen is a professional at it. She's the one who taught us that. You can even do it with no hands. Okay, There's a bug on me. Yeah. Hi, Luca. I can hold on to this. Mm. Yeah. That's easy. Everyone can hold on to that. That's easy, Ethan. I'm Let go. Oh my gosh, that's so scary. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you guys later. As usual, we are on our evening walk and the boys are going over there to the tennis courts while Alex and I do our laps. It's gonna be the same thing probably every night that we show you guys. The laps and tennis. Well, until we move. That's what I'm gonna miss about being at Uncle Michael's house. Yeah. Is um, coming to this park and doing laps and doing the tennis court thing. Yeah. So, yeah, because we're gonna probably move on the this coming payday. I think we've decided to move back to that house sitting position. It's not really a position. It's just a house sitting for a friend. So. Yeah, we're we need, we need to save money. You know, we really need, I need to get my surgery. I need to get my um, umbilical hernia surgery. And 
What else? I need to get my teeth done. Yeah. Um, I want to get my teeth cut. It's cheaper here. Yeah. Like yeah she probably doesn't have anything, but maybe a tiny one, if anything. Yeah, and um, from how old did I go first go to the dentist? Four years old. From four to 18, I only ever had two cavities. Yeah. So. Because I was a better mom back then. No, I'm a good mom, but <laughs> <laughs> but like I did everything so perfect with her. You know, I'm not saying I was a perfect mom, but I was pretty much almost a perfect mom. With the boys, I kind of slacked off a bit, you know, since Rich died. And uh, about almost eight years ago, a lot of like consistencies went out the window for a while and stuff like that. So, and plus my husband wanted to give the um, boys, not Ethan, because Ethan didn't drink milk at the time when he died, but, um, Rich used to give Richie chocolate milk when he turned one years old instead of regular milk. So that probably really damaged his teeth. And when you're married, you kind of have to compromise. So I didn't want to, I had to pick and choose my battles with certain things. You know, it's just the way relationships are. But anyway, also when he died, a lot of stuff went out the window. Consistencies with bedtimes, consistencies with, you know, certain things. So they kind of had a lot of dental work done, but not to the point of neglect, but but just a lot more than Alex did. I, I put, I had lacquer put, I think it's called lacquer, I don't know, but they put lacquer on your teeth when you're like four, and I think that really helped out a lot too. I didn't do that with the boys, because at the time they, they could get it, um, I didn't have the medical coverage that did it for Alex, so I don't know. Anyway. I'm going to stop blabbing and we're going to finish our walk here and then we're going to go play some tennis with the boys. Hey guys. Hi. You guys having fun? Yeah. Alex, get ready to lose. I'm going to get to this time. Okay, me and Ethan are going to play around then switch in with the Alex. All right. Let's go. Ow. So the boys are wearing their exercise outfits again. They'll probably be wearing the same ones every night and then we'll just wash them so if you guys see them in the same outfits every night it's because they're more comfortable in those clothes <laughs> and we don't have a variety of exercise clothes right now oh, so are you tired ethan you're getting tan ethan yep <coughs> I mean 30 love. I forgot. Oh, this, this, this. Oh, so we should Did you really or did you put it there? Awesome, babe. I missed it. Ethan got the ball over the fence. <laughs> Run and get it, Ethan. The, the, the plan is to run every time you have to get the ball. It's good exercise. Thirty fifteen. Okay, so we are taking a break from tennis and Ethan is swinging on the swings. You having fun, honey? Yeah. Are you going to jump off? Nope. No. No? I feel already too much. 
Richie's upset that we stopped tennis for a while. So he's over there watching our stuff. So you guys, this video probably isn't um, that long. And if it is, it doesn't have a lot to it. Um, we really didn't do much today. All we did is what? Play video games? Yeah, we played The Last of Us and then came here. <laughs> Wait, what? Okay, so right now, Mom is swing swinging. <laughs> and this video is probably not going to be that long, but I'm going to tell you what we did today. We played The Last of Us video game, and I beat the whole game of skate. And we, we decided to go to tennis today. And yeah. This evening. This evening. I mean, yeah. So, yeah. So right now... We have it too close up. This is how mom is Yeah. <laughs> I'm actually not nauseous. Usually when I swing I get nauseous. Yeah. Like for many years I got nauseous, but I'm actually not nauseous now. That's cool. Yeah. Wait a minute, I might have spoke too soon. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna jump off you guys. Let's see if I actually make it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be you. Can you I be plopped you, off. How about that? Me swinging and jumping off. Okay. I plopped off. Wait, take the oil for me to get the high. <laughs> How far can you jump off? <laughs> what? What'd you do? No. I think I know what you did. What? I'm not saying. <laughs> I'm scared to jump off this high. Just do it. Ready? Put your arms in the inside. What? In the inside? Like I did. Like he doesn't know how. Like this? No, no you gotta... No. It'll get caught like that. Just make sure you... <laughs> Don't get your arms caught if you jump off. Ready? I'm too scared. I'm going to hit the plastic. No, you won't. Ready? Go! Good job! <laughs> you did good! One more time. Okay, you did good. I'm going to try to do a 360. Okay. I'm going to jump off again. Good job! I'm a ninja! Richie threw the ball outside of the court. Gee, Alex, second time. Second time. Get over here and stop throwing it. Oh. Through the underhand. Throw here, underhand. here. It goes higher. I can do it overhand. Nope. You're I not as tired arm. as me, though. I have a good arm. <laughs> it's long, too, so maybe that's why. Yeah. <laughs> You're taller than me. I said I was long. Four inches. Well, my arms are lanky. They just don't look as lanky because I'm fat, but... <laughs> the boys are going to be upset that we have to go soon because we, we Uncle Michael has to go to bed for work tomorrow. So... Okay, so Mom has 15 and Ethan has zero. And uh, they're battling. I just beat Mom. 15, 15! Ethan just got a point. And uh, yeah, I beat mom. Um, so yeah, Ethan thinks he's gonna beat mom, but I kind of think mom's gonna win. Whoa, that was a nice one. Fifteen thirty. What? Get the ball. Okay, so anyway, I'm gonna end the video now. It's getting late. We're about to walk home. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below. We'd love to hear from you. And the question of the day is: emus or ostriches? Which is like the dumbest question ever, Alex. <laughs> um, so I say ostriches because they stick their head in the ground and their eggs are really big. I guess they are doing the same thing, but whatever. Um, 
Alec mom says emus. Ethan, what do you say? Uh, ostriches. Okay, ostriches. Alex, what do you say? Um, ostriches because I watched this one Fear Factor episode and they had to eat rotten ostriches raw. <laughs> That's gross. Anyway, see you tomorrow. Bye.